J.D. Nigel, Word of Truth, Bible Teaching with Jeff Deloach. Jeff Deloach. Jeffrey Allen Deloach. You want to fucking look me up? <laughs> you don't have to. You. <laughs> I'm here. Word of Truth channel with J.D. Nigel. Adonijah, one of the most fucking wicked fuckers of all Israel. Can I deny it? No. Am I going to deny it? No, because the Lord told me. You're Adonijah. I went, oh. I cry. I'm, I'm bummed. But I'm part of the family, and that's what I'm trying to tell you. The mercies of David, the tabernacle of David, is that love, that mercy that David, he had the heart of God. He's like, I feel bad for these kids, man. I feel really bad for these kids. I'm going to do the best I can. I'm going to get them away from these other people. I'm going to lead them. I'm going to bring them into some good land. I'm going to let them try and redeem themselves. I'm going to give them some laws. They're not going to be able to do it. He knew that. He knew that. He's like, I'm gonna set these fuckers up so so bad now. Adam's gonna have to Adam's gonna have to go through hell before he gets. In fact, I'm gonna probably kill him. And bring his spirit back to me. That's the only way I can do it. I have to I have to I have to kill that. That flesh has got to go. So what did he do? He gave up his flesh. He let his flesh get. Destroyed. Why did, why did, why did the body, why did the body disappear people? Cause he can't leave. You can't leave that that dirt, dirt and dust to be to be part of his kingdom. He, it, whatever he did with it, I don't know what it, where the body went. We don't care, and that's the point. We don't care about these bodies. We shouldn't care about this place, these bodies, any of that. The goal should be spiritual. Are you? Do you understand who you are? Do you understand where you're going? It doesn't matter if you're a Gentile. It's, there's nothing wrong with being a Gentile. It's easier. So I'm going to show you what Esau... Esau is an example of the Gentile mindset. He got, he got supplanted by Jacob. Why? Why... Are the curses so hard for us? Israel. Let's just stick with Israel for a minute. Why is that? Because we came in and we 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 took that blessing that was actually supposed to be for for Eve's children. Why was why was he why was Esau out hunting in the field? Because he was good with the animals. He was good with the with the carnal stuff. Eve was the mother of all living things. So Eve represents the Gentiles, represents Esau. Let me read you about Esau's blessing. Maybe you'll be able to get a better grip on this <sighs> metaphorical story. It's, it's, it's to open your spirit. It's not about <sighs> the 12 tribe chart. It's not about Joseph sperm, come on, sir. Esau begs for a blessing. And when Esau, this is Genesis, we're still in Genesis. We're at the beginning. This is where these individuals, they're not, they're, they're a lot different than we are. They were a lot different. They still had a lot of power, spiritual power. We're fucking, we're destroyed here. This is about as powerful as it gets. J.D. Nigel, fuck, weak, pathetic, 
pathetic. Telling you. Genesis 28 34. Esau begs for a blessing. And when Esau heard the words of his father, the words, he cried with a great and exceeding bitter cry and said unto his father, Bless me, even me also, father. <coughs> That's Eve going, Whoa. I see that I should have been paying attention to my husband. I see I should have been paying attention to my birthright. I see that I fucked up. Oh my God. Do I have to take all the blame? I mean, now I'm really getting screwed. Eve is saying that. And he's like, no, but it's all right. You're, it wasn't your fault. It was Adam's fault. It was Jacob's fault. She had control over herself. She should have known better. The Lord told them both, don't eat it. Because they were stuck together. They were supposed to stick together. They're better together. He cried with a bitter voice. What about a blessing for me? I didn't, I, I'm sorry. And he said, thy brother came with subtlety and has taken away thy blessing. Why did, why did Jacob come subtly? Because he's a fucking serpent. He's a devil. I've been saying this the whole time. We're, we're the fallen angels, people. Especially Israel. Think we're not? Take things way too literal, man. You gotta, you gotta start looking in the mirror, Israel. Especially you, Israel. You fucking stiff-necked, knuckle-headed appleheads. That's why they don't teach you how to read. You have no imagination. It's no, no godly imagination. So what they do? They put the, they gave everyone this jab, and you know what's gonna happen? that little bit of God that everyone had in them that was keeping this place from completely caving in. It's done, man. Man. You know, man? Right? Okay. It's done. You'll see. You'll see. People are going to get, you're wondering why people are acting so weird. Their pineal gland is just toast. There's no more connection. There's no more antenna. The antenna has, the cable's being cut. Cut your cable. Get wireless. It's spiritual people. Wireless. Get wireless. Cut the cable. You've been snipped. All you people that you better repent and say, Lord, restore my restore my antenna. Please. I want to hear you. Where are you? I'll go check out Word of Truth, JD Nigel. I'm, I'm over there. That's probably why I'm pissed. I'm like, damn. I thought in I thought the Lord would be like sending signals to people. Beep, 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 beep. The cable's been cut. Your brother came with subtlety and he said, Is not he rightly named Jacob? For he has supplanted me these two times. He took away my birthright and behold, now he has taken away my blessing. And he said, Hast thou not reserved a blessing for me? That's the Gentiles. That's Eve. He was he was in, he was responsible for all this. He's getting blessed. He's getting he's chosen. Don't I get chosen for something? And the Lord's go and Jacob's going. I I sure. Is Esau Edom? Is Esau Edom wicked white man and blah 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 the devil? They're the devil. 
Esau Edom represents Eve, people. That's family. That's why you don't abhor an Edomite. It's your family. Damn. Fockers. Okay. So he said, Isaac answered and said unto Esau, Behold, I have made him the Lord. I have made him thy Lord. Get it? I can't believe that, that everyone's just like bugging out. Bugging out. They, you're a bug out. You're a, you're a knucklehead. You're this. You're that. You're wicked. You're Edom. You're, uh, uh, uh. Come on, sir. Makes me sick, I'll tell you. It says it right there. I've made him your Lord. What did it say in Genesis? You're going to love your, your, your love is going to be for your husband, but he doesn't know you. He doesn't even like you. He's blaming you. Can you trust him? He's saying it was me and you that fucked him up. I put him in charge of my shit and he listened to you. No. He's going to get, he's going to get all the blessing he want, he needs. Right directly for me. Blessings and cursings. People get all confused. I'm blessed. I'm cursed. I'm blessed. I'm cursed. Same thing. Right hand, left hand. You're cursed to be blessed and you're blessed to be cursed. <laughs> Crazy, man. And Isaac answered and said, Behold. I have made him my Lord, and all that his brethren have I given to him for servants. And with corn and wine have I sustained him. And what shall I do now unto thee, my son? What's the corn and the wine? That's what I have. That's what I'm trying to give you. It's the, it's the knowledge, the wisdom, the spirit. I gave him the spirit. And it's going to suck for him. It's going to suck for him until the end. If he comes back to me, if he wakes up and doesn't start pointing his fingers everywhere, hey, it's them, it's them, it's them. No, it's me. <laughs> uh, what'd your parents teach you? To lie? Yeah, they did. Oh, just, just lie. Just tell me you didn't do it. Don't you think your parents know? Don't Now we don't trust our parents. Our parents don't trust us. Kids are fucking wicked because we've taught them to lie. Yeah, Christmas, a guy in a fucking sleigh comes around and drops presents. Cool, huh? And there's this Easter bunny. He brings eggs and candy. There is no God. You were born of a monkey. You used to be a monkey 10,000 years ago. If you're not good, we're going to shoot you to the moon and make you live on the moon all by yourself. We've been polluted by fucking nonsense, people. And it's just getting worse. Now, now people can't even have respect for the Bible. No respect. None. Yahweh Bahashem. Yahweh Shai Bahashem Rakakwadash. Kwam Yasharala. Really? <clears throat> and all his brethren have I given to him for servants, and with corn and wine have I sustained him. What's sustaining me right now? If I didn't have this word, if I didn't ha know this, the truth, as best I can figure out, far beyond anything anyone else is saying. Chuck Missler. Oh yeah, Adam wasn't even there. Yeah, he was. They were fucking bonded together. They were, look at the Adam and Eve seal, man. I, I, I don't just look at this shit and go, ooh, that's neat. No, I'm looking at it going, it looks like they were stuck together. The Adam and Eve seal. It's a little seal. And it has both of them on it and they're, they're fucking spooning in a way that they're stuck together like worse than two horny dogs, I'll tell you. Look at it. Pull it up. Do some research. Come on, sir. And Esau said unto his fa father, Have you but one blessing? B 
Bless me, even me also, my father. And Esau lifted up his voice and wept. What are the Gentiles saying? Is it just Israel? Is it just, is it just, is it going to be just Jacob? Lord, tell me it's not, tell me you have, tell me you have something for me. I have something for you, Esau. And Isaac, his father answered and said, behold, thy dwelling shall be the fatness of the earth and the dew of heaven from above. What's he saying? You get to rule over this carnal place. You're going to get to whack those spiritual chosen people. You're going to you're going to just make them filthy, disgusting. You're going to you're going to defile them. You're going to you're going to kill them. You're going to put them in the ground. You're going to kill their bodies until their spirit just can't take it anymore. They're going to wonder why, why, why they are so unlucky. Why are they so cursed until they come back? I'm using you as my whipping stick. You go out there. You get the earth. You get the dew. Every day you get that little bit of, just a little bit of knowledge, wisdom, and about me. I'm going to remind you. I'm going to remind you who's doing this. The dew is that little bit. That Gentile, that Gentile belief that these wicked people are trying to cut that off. I don't know who that, that vaccination kill hurts more spiritually, Israel or Eve. I, I haven't figured that out yet. It, the Lord might have made it to really mess up these people that have the dew. There's no more dew. It's dry. It's a dry place. There's no dew. And by thy sword shalt thou live and shall serve thy brother and it shall come to pass when thou have dominion that thou shalt break his yoke off thy neck. That's the point I wanted to make. What does that mean, people? That's why I went into the yoke the other day. The Lord's going, we're going to talk about the yoke pretty soon here, so... Just bring it out there. Let them know my yoke is easy. He took that spiritual power from us. You will break the yoke off his neck and you will actually have Wonderful blessing. You're not going to have to serve him no more. Here. Until we get to the kingdom. And depending on how you people respond to me. We'll see who goes where. I told you there's places for you. If it wasn't so, I wouldn't have told you. What kind of place are you looking for? What kind of place are you looking for? Three bedroom? Two bath? Four bedroom? Three bath? If you're not going to be in a cardboard box, you better start fucking listening. Um... I'm going to go watch the game. The yoke. Let me finish this. What's that mean, Israel, you GMS knuckleheads? That means that the Gentiles get to come in. That's the blessing. Esau said, I, I didn't, I, I, I wasn't in charge. Why are, you, why are you punishing me? I'll give you a blessing. Your blessing is you're going to torture your brother, you're going to teach him all kinds of wonderful lessons about how not to be a dick and how to love. And then I'm going to break the yoke between you and him so that I can 
make you my bride again. I'm going to bring you, I'm going to, you're going to be under Israel again. You're going to be under Adam. You're going to be under Jesus. You're going to come back and be yoked. That's your wife. Your, your hubby, your hubby, I'll bring your hubby back. And that's what Israel is, that's what I am trying to get you people to understand. We're supposed to be loving the Gentiles. We're supposed to be going, man, I'm sorry that I fucking ratted you out. Sweetheart, I'm sorry that I blamed you and God for my fuck up. To hear these guys, man, hating on, hating on the bride, the Gentiles, fucking pisses me off, people. That's not where we're at. The yoke is broken. These people are coming in. You better start loving them. I've been trying to explain this to you for months now. But I only have 80 subscribers. Do you believe that? That's how lame this place. That's how pathetic this place is. Pathetic. I'm here telling you the truth. Trying to apologize to you. Gentiles, sorry, Gentiles. I didn't mean to blame you. I should have took. I should have took fucking authority. I'm not eating that, Eve. Let's go talk to God and see what we can do. You don't look right. You look sick. I uh uh uh. uh. Let's go talk to the big guy. Before this gets any worse. No, I don't I don't want it. Put it down. Put put it down. I know it's hard to believe it's me. Hard to believe, huh? Fucking Hard to believe. Hard for me to believe. I'm trying to tell you people the truth. Everybody wants to hear some fucking nonsense. I'm sorry. I should have took authority. I should have told my brother, brother, I know I know dad gave you the kingdom. I'm I'm sorry I uh I thought it was gonna be me. I thought it was gonna be me, bro. Let's do this thing, bro. Let's do this thing, Solomon. Let's do it. I'm right I'm I'm right with you, brother. I love you, brother. I fucked up. I'm a good example of Israel, man. Fucking serpent, belly crawling, fucking disgusting, vile, proud. All right, J.D. Nigel, word of truth. I would say, tell everyone about me. Tell everyone that the truth is out. We know the truth now. J.D. Nigel's got it. He's he's the brother of Solomon. Do you believe that? He's he's Jesus' brother in the flesh. Adonijah. What? It's not going to work. Unless you really, 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 truly believe it. He's of those Benjamites. The son of my sorrow, that the, the travailing. Why are we travailing right now? Because we can't understand why this fucking thing won't go get birthed. Where's the where's the doctor, man, when the babies do? We got all these. Fucking, what do they call them? Practicing physicians. Practicing witchcraft. These aren't doctors. These aren't, these aren't PhDs. All right. I've had enough. I'm sorry. 
I'm sorry, Lord. I'm sorry, Eve. I'm sorry, Gentiles. I'm sorry, Israel. It's too bad. In curses, the book agrees. I'm out.